Hi there, welcome back to the channel. So if you are using Apple Watch Ultra and if you're overusing your Apple Watch Ultra, then it can give you a little bit of overheating issue. But if you let's say you are not using your Apple Watch Ultra a lot, but you feel like when you're wearing it, it just overheat a lot. Now, if you have this problem, don't worry. Let me just go ahead and show you a couple of ways that will definitely solve your overheating problem from your Apple Watch Ultra. Now, this problem can happen for software and sometimes it can happen for hardware. Now, if you want to just solve your software related problem, the very first thing that I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys, simply go ahead and give it a forced restart. Now, if you haven't restarted your device for quite a long time, then it can actually cause a problem. So all you want to do here, just go ahead and press that digital ground button and the power button simultaneously unless it shows you the Apple logo on your Apple Watch Ultra. So let's say you just give it a forced restart, but it still have the same problem here. Then the next things I'm gonna go ahead and talk about the background app refresh. Now, if you head over to settings under Apple Watch Ultra, if you scroll down here, you'll see this option called background app refresh. Now, just open this up here, and it will show you all those applications that you're currently using. So, based on the application that you don't need, you can turn these features off to avoid overheating issues on your Apple Watch Ultra. Or you can also turn up this option called Background App Refresh from your Apple Watch Ultra to solve your problem. Now, let's say you did that process too, but still you have the same problem. The next thing that I'm going to go ahead and talk about is the countless notification problem on your Apple Watch Ultra. Well, the next thing that you want to do, just go ahead and open up your Apple Watch Ultra settings and here you'll tap on notifications. Now, bear in mind, if you are receiving a lot of notifications through your Apple Watch only, then you it can overhead a little, but keep in mind, if you turn up these features, it will stop all this notification on your Apple Watch. So you can turn this off if you don't really need any notification, or if you need any notification, you can come back to the same spot and you can turn it back on. Well, if you turn up this feature here, it will help you a little to prevent the overheading issues on your Apple Watch Ultra. The next way, I'm gonna go ahead and talk about the application that you are using. Now, if you are using too many applications on your Apple Watch Ultra, then it can often cause a problem. So if you're using too many applications, then we recommend you simply press that power button once and it will show you all these applications that you're currently using on the background of your Apple Watch. All you gotta do, swipe it to the left and you will see this cross icon, tap on here and remove one on one from your Apple Watch Ultra to solve your problem. All right, now let's move on and talk about the next process. In the next process, we are going to talk about your storage on our Apple Watch Ultra. So although Apple Watch Ultra is a pretty good storage, now if you are installed too many applications and if it doesn't have no space, and oftentimes it actually can cause a problem. So if you just open up your settings on your Apple Watch, if you scroll down to your general there, you will see this option called storage. And if you tap on storage there, then it's going to show you all this application and the things that cost a lot of storage on your Apple Watch. And what you're going to do based on what you don't need, for example, an application or other things, you can remove it directly from your Apple Watch Ultra to solve your problem. All right, guys, now after doing all the process, if you still feel like your Apple Watch Ultra is still overheating, then there are a couple of recommendations we want to tell you and you need to follow. First, make sure the temperature you're in, it is not overheated. Now, because of your temperature, sometimes your Apple Watch can get overheated. Second of all, make sure to not to use your Apple Watch, especially while you're putting your Apple Watch on the charge. Well, the next recommendation would be just try not to use a dynamic watch face, just try to use a simple watch face to avoid overheating issues on your Apple Watch Ultra. Now, let's say you are maintaining all the things perfectly fine, but it's still overheating, then it can be the problem for the hardware. In that case, you want to take your Apple Watch Ultra to the Apple Care. Hopefully, they'll solve your problem for your Apple Watch Ultra. So, these are the, all the things that you guys can do to solve your overheating issues on Apple Children. If you find this video useful, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching this video and I'll talk to you later. Peace out.